Hey y'all, welcome back to Rated RPG, your number one channel for gaming news and commentary. I want to thank you for tuning back in today and so we can talk about some good news that coming out of Square Enix. And Square Enix, we've got a lot of expectations coming for them, especially with uh, E3 coming up not long. They've slated themselves to take Sony's hour-long press conference. Let's hope it's better than their... Uh, showing last year that 30-minute whoop-dee-poop, -whoop. but that's neither here nor there. Right now, we're talking about some good news, and that is Star Ocean. Star Ocean is a really good franchise. It's a really good storied franchise. If you haven't played the games, I definitely recommend you play them. And the big problem, though, is for a long time, we haven't been able to play the first Star Ocean here in America, or the PAL regions. The original Star Ocean launched back in 1996 and was a hit over in Japan. And we didn't even get a taste of it until the PSP remake, Star Ocean First Departure, launched in 2007. The first one we got over here in the United States was Star Ocean A Second Story on the PS1, I believe? Uh, not quite sure. I haven't played it yet. In fact, actually... My first Star Ocean game was Star Ocean Till End of Time on the PS2. Uh, yeah, this is a big favorite game of mine. I love this game. In fact, I still have the, some of the original bookmarks here in the guide here from when I was playing this back in high school. What Was it middle school? No, it was middle school because I remember I got this guide... Uh, betting on eBay. I think this is my very first eBay bid because there is so much intricacy to the uh, character interactions in this game that I wanted this guide really, really bad. So this was my first successful eBay auction in which I had to get in there and snipe it at the last moment back when sniping was still allowed. Sniper, no sniping. Since then, I've had the opportunity to play a couple of the other Star Ocean games, Star Ocean uh, Last Hope, and Star Ocean Integrity and Faithful Faithlessness. Last Hope didn't really get me. Integrity and Faithlessness, I like the story, and I really like the characters even, but oh, such terrible decisions made at the executive level to not have any cutscenes in Integrity and Faithlessness. That was so horrible just watching the 3D models just kind of talk to each other and having to pan the camera around to see with their lips moving or anything. Not to mention Integrity and Thesisness just suffered from the huge uh, downside of having very little in the way of world exploration and a lot of just repetitive fetch quest. But now we get an opportunity to take a look at the new old Star Ocean game. Star Ocean First Departure R has been announced for Switch and PlayStation 4. It's going to be a HD remaster of the PSP game, not a full remake. Uh, the Star Ocean games have been kind of slow coming out lately, but this is something I'm highly excited for. It's still going to be using some of the older sprite-based art, but hey, we see a lot of indie games nowadays that are just doing gangbusters even without uh, photorealistic graphics, and that's okay. So I'm very excited for this. I want to experience this story for the first time myself. I love my PSP, and I was actually planning on getting Star Ocean First Departure for the PSP at some point, but this is just phenomenal to hear. So please check it out. Don't hesitate when this game comes out. It's going to be a great entry point for the franchise. It's the first game in the series, so please take a look, and let's find out more, hopefully, from Square Enix at their press conference at E3. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching Rated RPG. I appreciate you tuning in. I appreciate you listening to this video. If you like what you heard, please be sure to give it a like, and please be sure to subscribe to the channel and turn on those uh, that bell icon so you can get all of my future content in a timely manner. Thanks for tuning in. Have a good night. Hey there, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please like and subscribe. And don't forget to hit that bell icon so you can get all the latest gaming news from Rated RPG.